Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Tiffany and this is Girl Mama Budgets. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Um, on this channel we cash stuff and we sink to save. Okay, first thing I want to say is, um, sorry for the camera shaking. <laughs> That's the first thing I want to say. No, but really, um, we're like one subscriber away from 200 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. It means the world to me. Um, once we hit 200 subscribers, I am going to do a giveaway. There will be two winners. And then technically everybody's going to be a winner because I'm going to give you guys um, a few freebies. So be on the lookout for that video. Hopefully next video I will be able to share that with you all. And I'm not going to count the money today. There's a lot. <laughs> Just know that. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and start by putting our cash into the piggy bank this is just from today this isn't a lot of uh, change normally i empty out my wallet every day um and just put it in there so 11 and seven cents eleven dollars and seven cents another thing that i want to say is um if you guys are new this setup will be probably the first and last time you'll see it because hopefully next video if everything comes on time, I'm getting a new desk chair and a new desk. So hopefully my whole setup will be brand new and I'm really excited about that. My desk chair is an actual desk chair, but it's like broken. The back's broke. So when you sit in it, you have to like hold the back to make sure it doesn't fall off whenever you sit down. It's old. So I'm super excited about getting a new one. All right. So we have 101s, 105s, and then some more fives, 10s, 20s, and 100. The first thing that I'm going to go ahead and get out of the way is we are going to do our no spend. Um, I have not put any money into it. If I did, I got it out and um, used it for my daughter's birthday. So we're going to go ahead and jump over here to January. Um, this will be for January's no spend. I got these... Um, really cute no spend stickers the hearts are no spends and the dollar amounts are spend days and i do five dollars a day that i do not spend money and so we only spent money one two three four five six seven eight eight days so me it was okay not the best not the worst so um we do owe 115 dollars to our no spend so there goes our hundred a ten and a five so there's 115 dollars for january no spend and i'm gonna leave this money in the no spend until the end of february at the end of february i will pull all of our no spend money out and today is friday the second i actually technically need to put a spend day for both of these um so uh yesterday I got um, a refund back on a bill, and so um, it was more than I was expecting, so I went ahead and purchased my desk chair and my desk, and um, had a little bit of extra money, so uh, that was what I spent yesterday, and then today I was at Walmart, and I got me some new Sharpies, so I know I said this was a Amazon and a... Um, Etsy no spend, but I did, I'm going to start saying spending for myself. So if I spend for other people, um, and it's budgeted, then it's going to be a no spend. But if I buy something for myself, then it's going to be a spend day. That's how I'm going to go for February. And after February, I don't know if I will be doing another no spend. We will just have to see how it turns out. So you know what I should do? I should take this money, the no spend money, and put it into our thing. You know what? Let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. So, let me see if I even get to it right now. My desk is a mess. So, normally I just put my no spend money in um, the no spend challenge envelope. This is by Donna Powered by Creativity. But you know what? So that I'm not tempted to touch this $115, we are going to put this money into move that can into the garbage i need to clean up my desk <laughs> oh goodness okay there goes everything so i showed you guys this a long time ago it's a um, indestructible piggy bank and the only way you can get into it is by taking a hammer and busting the end and then prying it open like a can so let's see 
let's go ahead and put this $115 into the, let's see, let's do it like this. Let's see if it'll take three bills at one time. So the first $115 will go inside. Let me see if I can show you guys. Inside here. Bye-bye. Okay, cool. Awesome. Yay, we got money in there. I was trying to figure out what exactly I wanted to do for that no spend, but that is actually probably going to be the best thing because I can't touch and be like, oh, well, you know, this is just money that I was saving from not spending money. So if I need it, I can pull it from there. No, that money can't be touched now at all. Woohoo. Okay. <laughs> now let's go ahead and, ooh, I want to go into, where did the binder go? Where did the binder go? Here it is. Sorry guys, I'm telling y'all, if y'all could see my desk, you would be like, oh my God. I'm trying to get everything organ uh, pulled out and organized, seeing what I actually need, what I don't really need, because um, when my desk comes in, hopefully Tuesday, I will be able to move this one out of the way, have everything stuck. You know how it is when you're changing and moving things. Okay, so the last video that I did this uh, binder in. I did not have the um, dashboards in. I made these dashboards and the video that I showed these dashboards was corrupted or something because it would not upload onto YouTube. So um, I made some dashboards for my people that I have in this binder. So we've got Ellie on Earth. I will try to link everyone down below. And we finished her um, scratch off for the um, what is it called for um it's like a friends saving together kind of thing she was doing um we finished that scratch off it was 35 dollars um so this one is a freebie on her channel this one is a i'm gonna make a roll and save we're gonna use one die on this one so the first time i rolled it was a five and again that was on that video that just did not it did not pan out. So there's my $5 and let's roll and see what next week we'll be doing. Really? Let's try again. <laughs> there, that's better. Six. <laughs> okay, let me grab, you know what? Let's grab one of my new markers. Let's see, this one's a hot neon pink. Let's put six here. And next week we will put $6 into this savings challenge. All right. Next up, we have Snow Gardener 307. Again, the last video that I shared, I finished a lot of these and I hate that I couldn't um, show that to you, but um, we started a new one. This is her rainy day fun from Snow Gardener 307. And I did like a flower garden with some snowflakes falling from the sky. And so we're gonna put $20 into this savings challenge. All right, and let me, and if you guys are new to watching me, I scratch a week ahead. That way I can kind of plan how much money I plan on um, needing for the next following week. So, all right, let's go ahead and scratch. This equals 100 and the dollar amounts are five through $20. All right, next week we'll only need to put five bucks in here. That is super doable. I'm hoping I hit the only 20 bucks. Um, first right off of the hand. All right, let's grab the vacuum. Vacuum that up. We will put the 20 in and next week we will put $5 in. All right, again, Golden Girl Budgets. I did the cute little, I don't know if that's a French Bulldog or if that's a, um, Boston Terrier. I think it's a French Bulldog, but it's super cute. Anyway. So with Golden Girl Budgets, I have a couple new ones in here. We did finish the ones that were in here. We're going to start this one first, and then we'll do this one next. So they're both $50 savings challenges. This one is $8, so we will grab a five. Um, hang on a second. I'm going to have to unwrap these ones. Five, six. Oh, gosh, that's going to bother me. Seven. Eight. Okay. And I am looking for F bucks. I'll have to go through these and look for F bucks. That one is an F buck, so I'm going to push it back here. Okay. So we needed eight dollars. We've got five, six, seven, and eight. Got to fix my money. All right. So there is that one started. 
how is everybody doing i hope everybody is having a good day this is for my girl liz over at liz and less she does the most amazing sticker challenges we are still working on the lovebirds so i did not finish this one let's see we got 10 15 I see 10, 15, 20, 25. Is that what I'm supposed to have? 15, 20, 25. Yes, okay. I'm making sure that I didn't snatch money from here. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and do this other 15. We'll do this other $15 bird here, and then we'll have 10s and 5s left. Okay, let's see. Let's put... Let's see, he's flying... So let's put him flying down here. Okay, there we go. So he's going to be flying and that is worth 15. So we'll grab a 10 and a 5. So there we go. Um, so we got 10, 15, or sorry, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So we've got $40 and this is a $75 challenge when it is complete. Alrighty. Then we've got uh, budget with mama bear and I thought it was fitting to do pink and a little mama bear so it was super cute all right let me grab if I can get a hold of it oh please don't fall everything like everything used to be super nice and organized and then I started going through papers and stacks and stuff and now everything's like trying to fall on me Okay, what we're going to do for Mama Bear is I did have the um, yes or no for the um, Stanley Cup, but um, I already finished both of those. Um, that was something that you guys didn't get to see, but this was another freebie that she did on um, Mondays with Mama Bear, and this is uh january was her birthday month so this is a 60 dollars savings challenge please don't mind the marker on it i had um a page before this and it bled through so we are going to put five and let's go ahead and do another one and make it 10 just because i feel like it <laughs> and we'll do ten dollars on this and this is a 60 dollars save super cute i love the uh, different cupcakes so cute so we're gonna put five and five which makes ten for budget with mama bear so we'll just grab a ten and put that there stack that over there i can't wait to get my new desk and get everything organized i absolutely hate being disorganized especially right, right now where i'm doing college work star budgets we finished hers but this is her little um dashboard that i made for her and then we've got Mischief Manage Budgets, Miss Wren. I love Miss Wren. She did my dashboards for my um, my um, long terms. And, oh, okay, I did not scratch this. Okay, I thought I'd already scratched one. Okay, this one is the really cute one. I thought this would be cute for Valentine's Day. It says we go together like, and it's so cute. This is save $50. So let's go ahead and do... Let's go over here and start from this side. I like how she has the different color scratch offs. That's really cool. Okay, so we gonna do, we gonna do, why am I talking like that? We are going to save $8 like we go together like burgers and fries. Super cute. Love, love, love that. Okay, so let's grab the eight before I forget. So there's five, six, that's an F book. Six, seven, and eight. Five, six, seven, and eight. All right. Well, let's go ahead and scratch another one so we'll know what to save for next week. Let's go with probably milk and cookies. Is that what it is? Oh, yeah. I'm good. <laughs> we go together like milk and cookies. Who loves milk and cookies? I am actually not a big milk or cookie fan. I like chocolate milk, I guess. I'm not a big cookie fan, though. I like a peanut butter cookie every once in a while, but... Okay, so next week, we're going to save $7, and this week, we saved 8 All right. So, there is my Rins challenge going. Yay. Then, we've got Janelle Ray Budget. She loves um, Jack Skellington, so, of course, it was fitting to put Jack Skellington on her 
uh, dashboard. Her and my daughter would get along super well. My daughter loves Jack Skellington, my youngest. Okay, so I did scratch this one and it is a nine, if you guys can see that right there. All right, so let's let's go ahead and scratch and then we'll get the nine dollars out or just go right here. Oh, okay, next week we'll save nine dollars again. Cool. All right, and this is save a hundred dollars. This is her coffee savings challenge. I thought it was really pretty with all the florals and stuff on the background. So I don't know if it's save 100 front and back or if it's save 100 on the front and then save 100 on the back because this is a double-sided um, savings challenge. So, all right, let's oh, get the $9 out. I almost forgot, oh my gosh. There's an F buck, so let's see. Five, five six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay, let me put that F buck in the back. So we've got five, five, six, seven, eight, and nine going into Janelle's budget or Janelle Ray budgets challenge. And we will also be putting nine in next week. All right, now we've got budget paparazzi. Her name is Rami. And I um, wanted to get a new one started for her. I have her dog one in the back, I believe for my dog binder, but um, so we, I scratched a three off and I scratched another one off. So we have uh, $5 total. So there's my five, let's scratch again. And again, this one is a save 50 and the denominations are two through nine only, um, but this is a front and back one. So I'm not sure if it's 50 on the front, 50 on the back for a total of 100, or if all together the front and the back equals 50. I, I have no clue. So let's go ahead and scratch another one. And this one is $8. So next week we will save eight. Let me get that off. All right. And this will go towards probably pets. I don't know. I haven't really decided how I want to do my sinking funds. I have no money in my sinking funds right now. Um, so I'm pretty brand new at all this. Um, so there is a budget paparazzi done. Let's see. Mm, let's come back to Donna because I can't remember what I did for her. Um, save with Judy. We scratched off, I scratched off a nine. And this is let's make a pizza. Thought it was super cute. So let's go ahead and get that nine dollars. So there's five, six, that's an F buck, two, three, four. Okay. All right, so we've got five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nine bucks going in for Judy. And let's go ahead and scratch another one off. Um, the reason I said I don't know what I did for Miss Donna, I don't know if I just went ahead and said, let's finish one, or if I said, let's hold off until we get some of her, because I have a whole book for her of a bunch of her um, like coloring challenges. So I don't know how exactly I decided to do that. So next week we'll be saving $8. This week, the $9 was anchovies, and I'm guessing that is spinach. And it says, let's make a pizza. So underneath is all kinds of um, different ingredients for a pizza. Tell me guys down below, what do you like on your pizza? I am a plain Jane kind of girl. I like pepperoni and cheese. <laughs> I mean, like I'll eat pizza with other stuff on it, but if I'm going to order it the way I want it, it's going to be pizza and cheese. I mean, pepperoni and cheese. So there is Save with Judy's dashboard that I made her. Then we've got balance and budget. And we are working on a pretty hefty one for her. We are working on the $125. I'm pretty sure I still have everything here. 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. Let me double check because I feel like I took a little bit of money out of one of these challenges for my daughter's birthday, but I cannot remember for the life of me if I replaced that money or what. So we've got 15 plus 10, that's 25, 25, 45, 65. So what I say, 20, 30, 40, 
45, 50, 55, 60, 65. Okay, no, okay, it's all there. Now we owe 15 because that's what I scratched off for this week. Man, these tens are just like yucky. All right, so there's a 10. And we need a five. So let's grab a five. Put that in between these really nice ones. All right. So now we have 20, 30, 40, 45. Oh my gosh, no. 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. And when we are done, this will be $125. So let's scratch off another one and see what we're going to be putting into it next week. All right, next week's another $15. Okay. So another $15 for next week. This one is from Lisa Grateful Me. Now, she does not technically do scratch-offs, but I wanted her in this binder because I love her challenges. So, we are going to do one of hers. This is her uh, little bunny challenge. It comes with three different ones, but I've only put two in here because I'm not sure how long it will take us to get through these. Um, we're going to do one, two, three, four, and five, which makes 15. And let's go ahead and color these in. So there's one, two, makes three, plus three is six, plus four is ten, plus five is fifteen dollars. There we go. So we'll be putting fifteen in for today. And I'm not going to put it inside the envelope until we are finished with this. So I'm just going to do it all like this inside um lisa's envelope and then once we finish one we'll put it inside the envelope okay this one's lisa grateful me's i had to put bright and beautiful colors and vibrant and um she is just a sweet sweet lady if you have not checked her out please go do so she's so sweet um all these ladies are really sweet but um that was her folder this is for la nova b um sh she has Let's see, Luna and Nova, those are her cat and dog. And then the B is for her name, which is Brittany. So I did paw prints. I don't know if you can see them. And then I did a little cat and dog silhouette for hers. And this was a freebie that she gave me from a purchase. And so um, the little mushrooms equal $5. And then the, I don't know, the little up, like um, get bigger kind of mushrooms. Uh, those are $5, and then the mushrooms that are, like, evil are $10. So, I scratched off a little um, level up mushroom. So, we're going to put $5 into this challenge today. And then, let's scratch to see what we're going to save for next week. Let's come over to this side. Oh, we got a $10 mushroom. Okay. Uh, get that off there. There we go. So we will put $10 into this challenge next week. Oh my goodness. Oh, that dollar's ripped. Okay. I can get that back in there. Okay. Okay, now I decided to pull everything from the back and we're just gonna start doing one at a time for um, this do the dog's challenges that I had. I was gonna do like a bunch of them just to save up for my dog. I have been looking and I have almost bought a couple times, but I'm telling myself, no, I need to wait. And so um, we're gonna just do one challenge at a time. We have $2 in there. I'm adding a five, that makes seven. So let's go ahead and scratch off another. This one is by, um, oh shoot, who's this by? Oh, this is by Lenova B, yeah. So this is another, Nilova, Nil, oh my goodness, I can't talk. Lenova B. And I'm leaving this one. I should probably make another little dashboard just for my dogs. I'm just going to wipe that away. Next week, we'll save $3. And I'm just taking my time on um, saving up for a dog. I don't, I'm not in any rush. I mean, I would love to have a dog right now, but again, we're not in any rush. Okay, this is TNL Budgets. I bought a bunch of her um, challenges. I have a bunch in my cart. She has really good deals on her challenges. 
They are a little high dollar. It says low income, but this is $15 that we owe this one. So we're going to grab a five and a 10. And then we're going to scratch off another one. This is a cupcake challenge. And let's see. Okay, now we have 11. So next week we'll be saving $11 on this one. Um, I had scratched this off and I just re-put stickers back on it. Um, so if you get scratch offs, you can totally do that because I don't know if I ever finished this one or not. This was when I first started. So we have $11. We're putting 15 in. And next week we'll put 11 in. All right. Then we have this one. This one is my challenge. Um, it's called the Love Bugs. This one's only worth $35. So very great for low income. Um, we're putting $6 into this one today. So a five and a one. There is six bucks. And let's scratch off another one. All right, next week we'll save five bucks. And let's go ahead and do one more because I would like to get a couple of these finished for Valentine's Day. All right. Okay. That's a three. So that's eight. Okay, we'll just leave it at eight for right now. Let's see what we can do. And if I can add more next week, then I will just um, scratch off more then. And I will probably try to uh, hit the um, Valentine's challenges. This week we got a 10 for like two peas in a pod. This is again my challenge. You can go over to my Etsy store. I will have it linked down below and um, get out. Oh my gosh. Told you everything was stacked, guys. <laughs> My, I put my piggy bank on top of other stuff and it just decided, nope, I'm not sitting there. Sorry for that, guys. All right, so there's 10 for this challenge. Let's scratch off another one. Let's see what we get. Okay, we've got an eight. So next week we'll put eight and this is worth $75. I did not put the denominations on this one, so I don't, I'm sure the highest number is 10. I try not to go over 10. I try to make most of mine low budget. All right, uh, 10 or 15, I don't think I've ever done like a 20 or whatever. Okay, so there is the $10 in there and we are finished with this one for today. All right, so let me put that aside. Okay, next we are going to go into, we don't need this anymore, let me put that up. Let's see, what are we going to go into next? Let's go into, where did I put it? <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all. Please send help. I hate it being like this. Okay, we're going to do this binder next. This is my um, Donna Powered by Creativity Challenges. And let me get that book. Here it is. So these are the envelopes and this is the challenges. So we finished the um, Finding Nemo one last month and we're going to start a few of these at one time. I have a bunch of hers. Um, so this one I made, I think it was $5 a piece for the big blocks. And now these little blocks are going to be $2 a piece. So let's go ahead and get started on this. Let's see, we'll do two. I'm just gonna go through and do this. It's gonna look horrible. Two, um, four. I'll go back in and color them later just to kind of make it quicker for you guys. Um, two, four, six. Ooh, that is green, not yellow. <laughs> I thought that was yellow, it's green. Two, four, six, eight, ten. 10. We'll do $10 on this one today. 10 and let's grab this one. Okay, so we'll do Woody's name today for 10 bucks. All right, let me get the $10 and put it in here. So there is 10, um, five. Oh yeah, I switched out all the twos because I didn't want to put them in the bank. So I put a bunch of twos in here for um, this challenge. So let's see. 
with the $10 that we're putting in right now, we had 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. We should have 35. So let's see. I am not doing it that way. So hang on just a minute. We got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 25, and 35. Perfect. So we have 35 into Woody. I'm not sure exactly how much he'll owe because I made up my own denominations on him. So let's go on over to Lilo and Stitch. Super, super cute. Let me see if I can back y'all up just a hair. Okay, can y'all see still? Okay, so let's do mm, three, four, five, Let's see, we'll do the three over here. I'll circle them and then I'll go back in and color them. So we'll do this three and then we'll do this one. That's four. And let's go ahead and do, yeah, let's go ahead and do this heart right here. Four, five, and we'll put five into this one today. I will go back in and color them nicer. I just don't want to take up all y'all's time. So we'll put five into stitch today. And there's a five already in there. So we have $10 in Lilo and Stitch. And Lilo and Stitch saves $100 when we're finished. All right, next up we'll go to Monsters, Inc. And this one is for Boo. Let's see. Um, let's do a 10 today for this one. And we'll do, do I want to do the door or do I want to do... Let's see, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, I could do two flowers. You know what, let's just do a door. Let's just do a door, that's simple. Let's do a purple door. All right, again, I'll go back in and color it nice. I just need to know what I'm saving. So we'll do $10 for a door. And you know what, I'm not really sure. We had five in it, so we have 15 now in Boo. Monsters Inc. Okay. I'm not really sure what it saves. She doesn't have the amount of what he's, what this one saves in the end. All right. Next up is Tiana. And this one is a $75 save. And let's see. I think I, uh, I, think I was going to do 15 into this one today. So let's see. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No, five and five is 10 and plus, yeah, that's 15. Okay, so we'll do another cluster here. My daughter's here, so if you hear her walking in, I apologize. I hear her getting off the bus now and she is kind of loud. I may have to edit this video and um, block her out of here. I'm doing a video. Hey, babe. I'm doing a video. All right, so we're gonna put 15 into this and we should have 15 in here. Yes, we do. So now we've got 20, $30 in Tiana and this again is a $75 save. All right, there's some pop in the back of my car if you wanna go grab it, baby. Um, uh, Madison, or Maya took them, I believe. I'm not sure where they went. Okay. Um. Next up, we did not do this one last time, but I wanted to do some Ariel. So let's get some Ariel in here. This is her, uh, oh, what is it? a Viewmaster. And we're gonna do 12 for this one. So there's 10, 11, and 12. And we'll get that colored in. We'll do the Sea Witch purple. So we'll color in this number 12. And she tells you on her, this, remember these are all from Donna. She tells you on her uh, channel how much these are worth, each Viewmaster, but I cannot remember off the top of my head. So we're gonna put 12 into this here challenge. So I have started college for those of you that have not watched any of my last, my last video. Um, it is kicking my butt y'all. Like, I am telling you the amount of math I have done in the last little bit is crazy. Okay, I don't even remember. I should have wrote it down. Um, I don't remember what I was going to do in this one. Let's go down here and get this little bubble. 
I don't know if you can see it. Let me, this little bubble right here, because I feel like I've missed that one. Okay, so we're gonna do $5 today, and we're gonna do right this little bubble right here beside Sebastian. So, oh goodness. There we go. Got $5 filled in, we'll put $5 in. And that's all we're doing today into this binder. Let me go ahead and put that $5 up. All right, there we go. So we're done with this. And let's see, where are we at on time? Okay, I'm gonna stop it at this today and then we will do um, another video with some more savings challenges because we're already at 35 minutes. So thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. And once we hit 200, I will do a giveaway. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.